You've probably heard of this infamous morning sickness drug, but the chemistry behind it? That is a mind-blowing story most people don't know. In 1956, thalidomide hit German pharmacies as a miracle sedative and morning sickness remedy. By 1960, an application for its American version, Kevadon, landed on the desk of a new FDA reviewer, Dr. Francis Oldham Kelsey. Something in the safety data troubled her. For 19 exhausting months, Dr. Kelsey blocked Kevadon's approval four separate times. Dr. Kelsey's persistence revealed two game-changing discoveries that transformed medicine forever. First, that a drug taken by mouth could actually cross through to the baby and cause harm. Before thalidomide, doctors didn't know this was possible. Second, she exposed the huge importance of something called chirality. This is absolutely fascinating. Sometimes molecules can exist in two forms that are mirror images of each other. Think about your hands. They're mirror images, but you can't perfectly stack them on top of each other. The same thing happens with some medicine molecules. But before thalidomide, scientists didn't realize that these different handed versions could have dramatically different effects in the body. In thalidomide's case, one version helped with morning sickness, while the mirror version caused serious birth defects by stopping blood vessels from forming properly in developing babies. So why not just give pregnant women the safe version? Well, here's where it gets wild. Thalidomide can flip back and forth between both versions inside the body. So even if you took only the safe version, it could transform into the harmful version while in your bloodstream. So the only true protection was avoiding it entirely. But this was just the first in a trio of medical events that would press pause on women's reproductive health research for decades to come. May is Women's Health Month, so we'll be highlighting stories like this all month long, ending with a very special and personal episode on our YouTube channel. So make sure to follow and subscribe to all our socials and our YouTube at Today Learn Science so you don't miss a single video.